everybody, this is Kevin with Inspiring How You See That, where the inspirational channel that goes behind the scenes, interviews some of your favorite artists, entertainers, and much more. So we're back with a Tech Tuesday and with DaVinci, and we're talking again about the volume settings. So make sure that you do like and subscribe uh, to this channel, and that way you'll get any notifications as far as any of our helpful Tech Tuesdays that are coming up. And that way it'll be kind of directed towards uh, what you're looking for, what questions you may have. Make sure you do put in the comments if there's something you're looking for, and we'll try to create as many videos as we can. Uh, in the last video, we talked a little bit about the volume settings uh, in here, just the simple volume settings, and you see that the clip was selected, and we turned the volume up and down in that clip. But today, we wanted to talk about um, how you set a certain segment within that clip. So meaning if somebody was talking real loud or just something just was really, really loud within a clip. Um, we're just gonna talk about the volume. In the next one, we'll talk about some implementation as far as removal of an issue, like if there was somebody mowing a lawn or if there was somebody yelling and screaming in the background or if there was somebody dragging something on the ground, you can edit those out too as well. Uh, but what you wanna do is on that timeline area, you'll see there's a little it looks like a razor blade. What that basically does is when you click on this, you'll click on that and then you'll select the area within the video that you, so if the volume's real high here and real low there, um, you will wanna just select that area. And I'll show you here on the next um, slide pick once we get this done. Okay, so I brought you down to the EQ line. Um, this is the line below your timeline, which has the EQ and the volume settings in it. You'll see, as you saw in the previous picture, where it just showed the volumes like this. But as you see, it's all white. That means that the the EQ, I mean, the volume is turned up so high that it's registering real high in here. And you can see I have it turned all the way up to 30. But let's say somebody was, you know, it was really, really loud in that area and you just wanted to turn it down. Now, of course, you can zoom in on this too and you know make your timeline extended out so you can really see in depth. Uh, that's pretty easy to do. So if you guys have more questions on that, just let us know. But uh, right now we're just talking about uh, turning this up or down in that certain area. So what you wanna do is you'll just take this and you'll take and move this down and you'll see the EQ uh, go down. So as you see, after I've set this down to 2.18, negative 2.18, you'll see the EQ is really high here with the sound, and then you'll see it real low. That's basically that area that we've just turned up and down. Now you can get, like I said, you can zoom these in, get into real fine tuning if you're trying to remove stuff or remove some noise. Uh, the next one, we'll talk about some of the uh, pitch areas and some of the issues if something's high or low, and we'll show you on that segment. So we hope this helps, and we'll see you on the next one.